All right, uh, Mr. Reddy and Srinidhi, we're going to start the session now. Myself, Lovepreet Verma, I'm the founder of this company. Is my voice is audible, screen is visible to you? Yes, sir. Okay. And what about Mr. Reddy? Yes, sir. Okay, great. Thank you so much. This demo will take approximately 35 to 40 minutes in okay. which we'll discuss writing task two in detail, how to get more than seven bands, have pen and paper handy. If you would like to write down anything, you can also take a screenshot if you want, in which I will, I will explain what type of services we're going to provide you in the package. Plus I will show you how our listenings will be there in the real classes, how reading would be there. So we're going to discuss this, it now. We are the first institute in India having PhD English experts in our team. All our experts are IDP and BC certified. Just give me a second, please. Uh, Vikas, you just joined. We just started. Is my voice is audible to you? Screen is visible to you? Yes, sir. Uh, Vikas so Joshi just joined. Okay, Vikas, we just started. Okay. So okay, as, as I said, we have PhD English experts in our team and our all experts are IDP and BC certified. So you're going to get training from certified experts only. Zoom live instructor led classes will be there every day. One and a half hour to one hour, 45 minute class will be there every day from Monday till Friday. Saturday, there will be mock test and Sunday we share resource material. We will provide you one mobile application in which you can review your own sessions. For an example, you're going to attend session today. You can review it by tomorrow in your mobile application. Every session is going to be recorded at the back end in our system and it will be updated next day. Plus you will be able to review hundred plus previous sessions from different trainers. Practice account. We will provide you one practice digital account with 160 practice test apart from live classes, you will be able to practice reading, listening, writing in your free time at your end. Anytime we will provide you username and password. One practice account dedicated mobile. We will provide you mobile app. If you do not have laptop or computer at home, still you will be able to operate entire material on your mobile. Regular assignments will be there. Regular feedback will be there. Five full length mock tests. We will provide you in your practice account. I will show you this practice account in upcoming slides. This is the practice test account guys, which we will provide you as a complimentary. Let me show you the live interface. Is this account is visible to you guys? It says when your English logo, it says Burma here. Is it visible to all of all three of you? Yes, it is. Okay, great. So your name will be pop up here. Once you will enroll with us and we'll provide you this account and this account will be validate for six months minimum. If you click on online test, you will be able to see five full length mock tests. There will be two section IELTS academic IELTS journal. If you're a student of IELTS academic, still you will be able to explore the journal training material and vice versa. If you click on IELTS academic, you will find five full length IELTS mock test will be there. It's full length mock test. That means every mock test will take approximately two and a half to three hours to attempt, just like real IELTS exam. First listening will start once you will finish the listening. Reading will start once you will finish reading. The writing section will start. If you click on academic readings, you will find you will find five sections further. Every section further going to be have five academic readings. 40 questions, 60 minutes. Once you will attempt any reading, it will turn yellow and you will be able to see your own analysis. Once you will attempt any test, you will be able to see how many wrong you did, how many right you did. You will get proper bands over there. 
you will see question wise analysis the right answers will have uh, you know green mark and red one have uh, red one would be the wrong one if for example 34th you got wrong you can click on it you can see the detail why it's wrong you will you will be able to see the right answers as well so entire analysis will be will be there uh, in each and every test so as i said 5 into 5 25 academic readings will be there if you click on listening again there will be sections every section further going to be have uh, five sections so there are uh, some couple of new listenings 25 listenings will be here so if you click on any test 40 question 45 minute every test is going to be time bounded test as the real test IELTS test will be there so 25 listenings you're going to get here if you click academic writings again five section every section further going to be have five writing section and every writing section going to be have two question writing task one and two that means five into two ten ten into five fifty fifty writing task will be there charan preet is my voice is audible to you screen is visible to you you just joined We just started. We didn't miss. I will explain the previous slides at the end of the class. So just stay in the class. Don't leave the class. So guys, similarly, if you click on IELTS journal training, you will have five full length journal test, 25 journal readings will be here. And then 25 yes, sir. listenings. And yes, sir. Yes, sir. Uh, who's this? Charan Preet. Hello. Uh, yes, sir. Yes, Charan Preet, just stay in the class. We just started the class. Uh, don't leave the class. I will explain whatever you miss at the last of the end, at the end of the class, okay? Because I respect everyone's time. I don't want to waste anyone's time. So just yes, stay, stay in the class. I will explain everything at the end of the class. So this is the practice test account, which will provide you as a complimentary, as I said, academic and journal section will be there. In journal, you will find 25 readings in journal you will find 25 readings journal readings 25 listenings 50 writing tasks this is for the practice apart from your live classes if your grammar skills are not up to the mark you can go into this challenge zone and play all the grammatical concepts and you can enhance your gramma grammar skills as well apart from this account will provide you one mobile application. If you go to our website, venueenglish.com, in the download section, you will find this kind of mobile application. Once you will download it, after enrollment will provide you a license key. And once you will have a license key, if you're a student of academic, you will see academic videos like this. And if you're a student of general, you will be able to see your on videos plus previous videos, journal videos. Now coming back to the presentation, guys. Is any doubt until this point? Any question, Charan Preet, Mr. Reddy, Sirinidhi, Vikas? No, sir. Okay, thank you. What about others? No? Okay. So guys, this is uh, going to be- No, sir. Okay, sir. This is going to be the schedule of our classes. Monday to Friday will classes will be their regular classes. As on Monday we discuss, uh, we do listening plus speaking, reading, writing will be given as an assignment. Uh, we you know shuffle the modules as per the requirement as well. Every day formal speaking will be there. You will get the feedback right away. Every day you will get the writing task and its feedback every day. Plus, we will shuffle the modules. Two or th three modules will be discussed every day. From Monday till Friday, regular classes will be there. Saturday, mock test will be there. All four modules will be assessed. And every Saturday, we'll check your performance, like where you stand and where your performance is going. Your trainer will assess it. Sunday, we share blogs, study material, videos, tips, so that we can add value to your learning. This is how your trainer will evaluate your task. Once you will assign any assignment, for an example, writing task two, you will get in your 
whatsapp group uh, we will allot you a whatsapp group in which your trainer will be there our whatsapp group our groups are very focused and sincere we do not give admission to non sincere students that is a mandatory requirement of our company we are very sincere to our efforts and dedicated towards efforts so once you will share any writing task in the group this kind of evaluation will be given to you as per idp and bc standards task achievement coherence and cohesion lexical resource grammatical range and accuracy so you're going to get even a small mistakes you i mean your trainer will elaborate each and everything in detail now i'm going to show you how the listenings will be there in the real classes because why we are showing these modules because um, many companies just give simple demo class and demos are just amazing and after that student feel dissatisfied like classes are not up to that mark but we show everything just for the clarity so you get an understanding what would be there in the real classes so on listening day basically your trainer initially explain tips and trainings for 5 to 10 minutes what type of questions will be there where to attempt what uh, where to focus where not to focus what to attempt if you would have certain kind of uh, problems and queries you can discuss with your trainer like you are facing trouble in map kind of question you can discuss and ask your trainer how to solve these kind of question then he or she will explain you the way out now initially 5 to 10 minutes he or she will explain you tips and trainings after that he or she will ask you to write down 1 to 14 numbers on your notepad so that you can write down answer simultaneously you see the video so once you will write down 1 to 14 numbers this kind of video will be played to you i'm going to play it for just 30 seconds so you will get an idea how the listenings will be there in the real classes listen can Hopefully, would that fit in with your plans? That would be fine. I'll... Graduates embarking on careers in the worlds of fashion and design are buying up the new apartments recently built here to replace the small houses where the market workers used to live. The narrow old side streets are great and novels. You now have half a minute to check. So, what exactly do people want to hear? guys was that audible to you yes sir yes sir okay. all right and what about vikas yes so yes it was audible thank you sir ashif khan you just joined your voice is uh, your mic is not open kindly just give me a second So guys, this kind of uh, listening will be there from first till fortieth question. Once you will attempt all the questions, the real answers will be shown to you, and your trainer will dictate each and every answer from first till fortieth. And if you would have any query question like twenty sixth, you got C instead of A, you can ask your trainer, "I got C, and why it is A?" Then he or she will go back to twenty sixth question. and explain you the logic behind it why it is a and why it is not c okay now on the reading day similarly 5 to 10 minutes your trainer will explain tips and trainings and how many reading questions will be there what type of questions will be there once the question tips and training will be covered in 5 to 10 minutes this kind of reading will be shown to you your trainer will let you know how to read the instructions because it is very important to know it after that he or she will explain you how to read the questions how to mark the keywords once you will read the questions you will be given almost 8 to 10 minutes to read the paragraph once you will read the paragraph you will come up with the answers the real answers will be shown to you and still if you would have any doubt for 11th you got a instead of b you can ask your trainer i got a and why it is b then he or she will explore explain you the logic behind it why it is not a and why it is b why i'm saying this that you can discuss each and everything with your trainer in the class 
now we're going to discuss how to get more than seven bands in writing task so guys more 10 or 15 minutes will be there just stay there in the class don't leave the class there are four parameters and four pillars basically in the writing task to get higher bands on which the writing score is going to be assessed task achievement and response coherence and cohesion lexical resource grammatical range and accuracy now task achievement and response means how you going to achieve the task how you going to respond the task for an example only introduction alone has three parts background information paraphrase statement thesis statement if you miss any of these three parts you will not get the full bands of task achievement and response coherence and cohesion implies a perfect linkage between lines as well as paragraph an ideal writing task too must be linked from the very first line of the first line of the introduction till the last line of the conclusion everything should be linked properly with the help of connectors furthermore moreover besides in addition to firstly secondly thirdly just like that lexical resource means what type of vocabulary you going to use whether you're going to use high vocabulary words or low vocabulary words or you're going some student just use very flory language high vocabulary word and even then they end up with five or 5.5 bands because they are not sure of the meaning of exact meaning of vocabulary word so we'll not use any vocabulary which we will not sure of grammatical range and accuracy means what type of sentence structure you're going to use whether you're going to use simple sentence compound sentence complex sentence complex compound sentence or you're going to write on passive voice and usage of punctuations so everything going to evaluate on the basis of these four pillars every pillar is having zero to nine band if you get seven bands here six here 5.5 here six here then the average of these four will be your band scores now these are the five normal type of essays any type of essay can come to you in the real ielts exam opinionating essays will be there advantage disadvantage essays will be there discussion essays will be there problem solution essays will be there direct question essays will be there every kind of essays having its own treatment we cannot apply one treatment to all of the essays we teach our students how to deal every kind of essay individually separately any doubt till this point guys no no sir okay thank you so this is a high band structure guys if you uh, kindly unmute your, uh, mute yourself this is the high band essay structure guys if you will follow this structure you will definitely get more than seven bands and this is the simplest way of writing writing task too as i said introduction alone has three parts background information or journal comment plus paraphrase the topic plus thesis statement if you miss any of these three parts you will not get the full bands of task achievement and response now what is background information background information is an information which tells something about the topic in the past for an example in yesteryears people used to wear simple clothes but due to the advent of modernization and globalization they tend to or masses tend to wear sophisticated clothing so in yesteryears or in past years people used to wear simple clothes so background information basically bring the topic from the past till the present what was happening in the past and what is happening nowadays now in on certain topic it's hard to make the background information due to the sensitivity of time then we can write down a journal comment journal comment is just like nowadays people tend to wear sophisticated clothing owing to modernization and globalization that is a journal comment plus paraphrase the topic paraphrase is an art of conversion of question into your own words in the introduction so you need to convert the question into your own words in the introduction some people believe that others are against to this just like that plus thesis statement thesis statement basically is 
a great indicator to the reader that what we're going to write down in further body paragraph. Along this introduction indicates the examiner what we're going to explain further. I'm going to discuss this point in subsequent paragraph or upcoming paragraph. That is kind of this state. It works as a linker as well. It links the introduction with the body paragraph. As I said, coherence and cohesion is very important. Now, in body paragraph, it has been seen that students just add so many points and they fail to elaborate. They add 10, 15 points in two, three paragraphs, but they fail to elaborate. They end up with five or 5.5 bands. What we need to do to get higher bands, we need just one idea, one point per paragraph. Explain, write down one point, explain it well, elaborate it well, support it with example, that's it. Your paragraph is ready. For writing task two, you just need two to three ideas, but we need to write down in clearer manner. Can, I will explain this step by step in upcoming slide. In conclusion, you need to write down the gist of the essay, crux of the essay. You can also rephrase it. Entire writing task two should not be less than 250 words and not more than 300 words. Some people may think that how to write, how to count the words. You can count one line and if your line has 10 words and you have written 26 lines, you would be on the safer side. Guys, now we'll do a small activity. This is called brainstorming activity. Those who will participate, I will appreciate. Those who will not participate, just stay there in the class, observe the class. So guys, uh, this is the real question which came to the real IELTS exam. In some countries, many more people are choosing to live alone nowadays than in the past. Do you think this is a positive or negative development? Now imagine yourself, you're living alone in Canada. Tell me the advantages of living alone one by one. What would be the biggest advantage of living alone? Uh, uh, we can uh, be an independent person. Very good point. So full freedom will be there. One can enjoy full freedom. One can be full independent. Dependency will not be there because if one is living alone, he or she has to do everything. Very good point. Next point. Mr. Khan. We can live by, by our own rules. Yes. Not so, depending on very others. Good point. So no dependency or no interference. So dependency will be covered in first point, but no interference. No one will be there to disturb. One has not to ask anyone or, you know, no need for any permission to go anywhere or to do anything. Very good point, Shrinvi. Next point. Charanpreet, Mr. Khan, Vikas, Srinidhi, Mr. Reddy. Uh. We'll get to know our uh, flaws in our own, uh, I mean, you can say, you can get to know your, what are your weaknesses. So one can do introspection. Yeah, you can say that. Yeah. So one can walk his or her own self, like where he or she is going and what is, you know, wrong. Plus we can say you will come to know the value of family. If you are living apart from the family, then you realize how family is important, right? So one will realize value of family. One will learn new skills, right? Such as what type of new skills one can learn guys. If imagine yourself, you're living alone in Canada. Cooking. Okay. Very good point. So first thing, <laughs> see, see, you are just imagining yourself. huh? So first thing one will learn cooking, cleaning of house, cooking, many chores, home chores one can learn, right? Plus think about financial side guys. 
give me the points there is one person from vivo mobile may I know the name please i need to rename the id who's just joined yes please your name please from yeah, vivo my name is rajesh i will just yeah, I... rajesh yeah, yeah my name is rajesh rajesh yeah. okay. thank you rajesh i will have the thank you sir you just joined don't worry you didn't miss much i will explain the things at the end of the class okay so just stay in the class okay you can participate in the class we are just doing brainstorming so this is the topic in some countries many more people are choosing to live alone nowadays than in the past do you think this is a positive or negative development so just imagine yourself you're living alone in canada on a pr basis or as an immigrant or as a student so what would be the advantages of living alone we have discussed full freedom will be there no interference introspection plus value of family one will come to know new skills one can learn such as cooking cleaning of house guys budget management one will learn how to on how to spend and how to save that is very important any other point pradeep you just joined um, i will explain the things to you at the end of the class just stay there in the class don't leave the class okay any other point vikas srinidhi rajesh mr reddy pradeep charanpreet mr khan guys is my voice is audible yes sir okay any point guys just points not lines advantage of living alone i'm just asking we covered freedom will be there no disturbance introspection value of family new skills budget management more exposure thing guys just give me points more exposure will be there one will expose to new culture languages people all right tell me the biggest disadvantage of living alone okay i'm expecting one point from feeling everyone. lonely sir very good point ma'am homesickness we call it homesickness so mostly students feel homesickness over there they fall in they fall into uh, they feel loneliness over there then they fall into depression due to depression they may fall into bad company so we have to link the ideas so whatever we going to write down we have to clarify it in order to get more than seven bands okay what is the second point disadvantage of living alone so guys once you will imagine yourself then you will be able to generate content i would encourage you to generate content next point asif charanpreet pradeep prudvi rajesh srinidhi vikas quickly guys no no one will going to help you we ourselves we have to very good point lack of family support okay lack of family support no one will be there even in case of emergency as corona happened recently we have passed we have passed through this phase so those who live alone it's those who were alone at that kind of time it was very difficult for them no one will be there in case of emergency lack of safety so if he or she is living alone bad people come to know they can take advantage of it right so another financial point we can say we can add one point more one has to bear all the expenses alone in family settings two two three you know earning hand would be there they share expenses but if one is living alone comparative to family he is having less expenses but he has to pay all the expenses alone so no one will be there to guide
guys i'm expecting more points from you guys just tell me if you have in anything in mind it will really help you so disadvantage of living alone no all right not an issue so guys why i'm asking you to uh, participate and why i'm showing this activity in every writing class we have brainstorming activity just like this in which your trainer will help you to generate content why we have integrated it because we have seen thousands of students that they feel i mean majority of the students feel blank in the real ielts exam when they go to the ielts exam they you know experience that environment they feel blank over that uh, at that point like points are not coming to their mind to overcome this kind of disability we have integrated brainstorming activities in our classes so that every day you guys will generate content and your brain will start functioning in that direction and in the real ielts exam you will have umpteen abundance of points so you won't feel helpless over there this is the whole idea to tell you about it so we have this brainstorming unique activities in our classes now we'll discuss the writing task 2 which topic we just picked using this method which i just explained earlier is there any point or any doubt until this point all of you mr khan charan preet pradeep mr reddy rajesh srinidhi vikas no sir all clear what about others kindly reply me guys i respect your time no sir okay thank you all right so now we'll discuss the topic in some countries many more people are choosing to live alone nowadays than in the past do you think this is a positive or negative development this kind of topic we can handle in three ways we can write down all the positive positive about it or we can write down all the negative about it or we can balance the statement we can say it has more positive consequences than the few negative ones we can show the extent we can give the 70% positivity and 30% negative views now these are these days many people choose to live alone especially in metropolitan areas and this rate is for higher in developed countries such as canada and seems like this has become quite normal there see the length of the sentence this is a complex sentence in which we covered journal comment and paraphrase together now in the question it is being asked do you think this is a positive or negative development we have to answer it in the introduction we have to show our side i believe this trend has more positive more positive consequences than the few negative ones so we have shown the extent that it has more positives like 70% positive but it has 30% negatives too let us discuss the topic in detail before reaching to the conclusion this is a thesis line this basically links the introduction with the body paragraph it also indicates the reader what we going to write down in further body, uh, body paragraph now in body paragraph what we need to do we need to write down one point elaborate it well cite an example now what is the one point the single person family those who live alone we call it single person family is seen to be positive from better personal skill development and economical perspective so we have said that it is better for those who live alone it is better from two perspective personal skill development perspective and economical perspective how it is better that we going to explain now that is elaboration part a single member family now we use single member family earlier we used single person family so we will use synonyms forces a person to learn some basic skills including cooking cleaning of house paying the utility bills managing personal finance purchasing daily commodities adopting hobbies and many more important skills so we have clarified the first point why it is better for the personal skill development side 
to living alone. Now, this makes someone self-dependent, which has a greater impact on the development of the country in a broader sense. In a broader sense means if one is living alone, he or she will earn money, he or she will pay taxes, which will eventually be beneficial for the country. So now we covered economical perspective as well. For instance, research shows that students who stay away from their home for their tertiary degrees, higher degrees, learn more skills and become more self-dependent than pupils who study from home. Pupil is the synonym of students. So in example, we have clarified our point that those who live separate from the home, they become more self-dependent and skillful. So what we did, we write down one idea, we elaborated from this point till this point, we cite an example to support our main point. That is the idea behind it to get higher bands. So this is the clearer manner. If you will write down in this manner, you will definitely get more than seven bands. So example, you can make it, you can fabricate it. It's not important. Example should be a fact from the journal or newspaper. No, you can make it, but it should be supporting to your main idea. That is the whole point here. Now in writing, Paragraph two, as we have balanced the statement, we have, we will, we have written positives in the first paragraphs. We'll write down some negatives in the second paragraph. From the opposite viewpoint, the trend of increasing single person family has few negatives outcomes as well. How, what are the negatives that we're going to discuss now? The increasing trend of living alone has a direct relationship on the percentage of people suffer from psychological problem th these days. Those who live alone suffer more from psychological problems. Living alone creates loneliness and depression. Whereas those who live in a family settings always find someone to share sadness and stress. So here we have shown the comparison of those who live alone and those who live in a family setting. If you show the comparison, it's wonderful. The isolation often leads people to choose a lifestyle that is often negative. How? For example, a recent study reveals that single person family members often rely on drugs and many of them become addicted. Because no one will be there to stop. The human is a social being and living alone is against their natural tendency. For many, bearing the total expenses is tough and this leads them to get involved into crimes such as robbery, snatching, etc. So what we did, we write down one point, we elaborated it well, we cite an example to support our main point. That is the whole idea behind it. In conclusion, to encapsulate, to sum up at the end, these kind of concluding phrases will be used. The number of single person families is increasing in this contemporary era or modern era. And this has omnifarious. Omnifarious is the synonym of various. This has various positive aspects despite some negative consequences. So guys, we again reinforced our idea in the conclusion. Whatever we have written in the introduction, we rephrased it in the conclusion. Hence, one can learn numerous cardinal skills, important skills of life if he or she choose to live alone. So guys, this is the end of writing task two. If you have any question, I just explained it using this method. We will follow this method in all our classes to get higher bands. Now, if you have any question, update me. I would happy to answer you. Mr. Khan, Charan Preet, Mr. Reddy, Rajesh, Srinidhi, Vikas. Any question? No, sir. Everything no, is clear. sir. All clear? Yes, sir. All right. What about you, Srinidhi, Rajesh, Vikas? Yes, sir. Okay, great. So after every yes. class, in I mean, after every session, you will have a speaking practice session at the end of every session. So this kind of cue card will be given to you. Your trainer will let you know how many questions will be there, what time duration, how to speak, what type of tips, how to make a, you know, spider diagram in less than one minute. In the real IELTS exam, basically 
the exam speaking exam will be from 11 till 14th minute 14 minute 14 yeah maximum 14 minute in which three section will be their first section will be of the generic in nature your examiner will ask you the question uh, journal question like tell me something about your previous studies tell me something about your interests just like that after that you will be given this kind of q topic q card topic in this section, you have to prepare in less than one minute. So you will be given uh, one minute to prepare for the topic and you have to speak up for minimum two minutes, at least two minutes you have to speak up. We teach our students uh, how to prepare in less than one minute in our classes. We have several techniques to do that and how to speak up for more than two minutes. So basic technique behind is you need to introduce the topic in one to two lines. After that, quickly you need to cover these bullet points. And then in one to two line, you need to conclude the topic. And using any connector, like furthermore, additionally, moreover, you can extend the topic as long as you want. But we need to cover the content in first one and a half minute because after that, Examiner can stop you at any point of time. Now, how to speak up more than two minutes, how to add stuff or create stuff. We teach our students to use the power of imagination. Now, what is the power of imagination? Power of imagination says you can add up, you can imagine even those things which are not prevailing in the real time. For an example, if I living in a small town, I can still describe Toronto, Michigan, Melbourne, and just name my town. For an example, if examiner will ask me to describe my hometown, I would say I live at Ludhiana. It is cosmopolitan. We have a wonderful lake on the southern side where people love to visit in the evening. We have multifarious shopping plazas in our city. We have world's renowned university in our city. We have world's oldest church in our city and our city is having perfect infrastructure. Just like that. Whether these things prevailing in my city or not, examiner is not going to check the facts. He or she is going to check your sentence structure, your vocabulary, your fluency, how you're going to tackle the topic and you know, how you behaved over there, your body gesture, your confidence, confidence level will be evaluated. So each and everything will be evaluated over there, but not the facts. So you can use your, you know, power of imagination and you can explain each and everything in a detail, thorough detail. So we help you to practice this in our classes. So guys, uh, we have flexible schedules. You, uh, this is the end of the session guys if you have any question let me know and if you are interested to join our expert classes most welcome just share your resume where you got the link and we would be happy to serve you we have academic and journal separate groups going on uh, at different timings and we have uh, as i explained earlier we have idp and bc certified experts so we have PhD English, English experts in our team. We have BC or IDP experts in our team. Your trainer will be certified trainer. One and half hour class will be there every day, Monday to Friday. Saturday will be mock test. Sunday we share resource material. And these two accounts we will provide you. Uh, this account will have 160 practice tests, including academic and journal both material and will validate for six months and similarly you can review your own recordings just in case if you miss any class, your concept will not be missed. You will be able to see or review your class next day in your mobile. So these are the unique feature, which none of the company in the world providing at this lower cost, uh, even at higher cost, none of the companies providing these features, uh, regular assignments will be there. Regular feedback will be there. Any question, Mr. Khan, Charan Preet, Mr. Reddy, Rajesh, Srinidhi, Vikas. No, sir. Okay. No, sir. Okay. What about others? Rajesh, Vikas, all clear? 
Yes. Okay, great. So, guys, this is the end of the session. Uh, I have shared. These are our phone number, direct lines, seven nine seven three one six two seven zero, where you got the link to join this session. Just drop your email over there, and we'll get back to you. Thank you so much sure. for your precious time. I really appreciate your time, guys. Have a wonderful evening. Good night. This is the end of the session. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Welcome, ma'am. Thank you so much, sir. You're welcome, sir. Welcome. Thank you, sir. Take care, all of you.